I just checked, and we've hit 100 subscribers. Real-time news droppage, ladies and gentlemen. Real-time news a droppage. 100. Let's go. Hello and welcome back to Bad Magic with the citrus fruit that refuses to use any other currency other than the United States $2 bill. Me, moldy kumquat. Now, today we are coming at you with a blast from the past. So what do you mean by that, Moldy? I'm going to tell you exactly what I mean by that. Today we are playing Ash Lizzle's Mono Black Massacre Girl deck. And if you do not know this yet, this deck was the most viewed deck on all of YouTube earlier in the month. And that's pretty freaking sweet. So I did try it out uh, back earlier in the month and I just bombed. So I shelved it. And I brought it back out today, and boy, am I glad I did. Because today, ladies and gentlemen, we went 8-2 and two with this deck. And that, to me, is really freaking sweet. So, I did make two changes to the deck. I took out two Evolved Sleepers and put in two Duress. Now, I made this change simply because I only own two Evolved Sleepers on here, and I was not going to craft two more of them since this card will be rotating out. So I just switched it out with two Duress that I already had. Not a big deal, and did not seem to hinder the deck at all. So if you want a full detailed deck tech on this, I highly recommend you going over to Ash Lizzle's channel, give her a subscribe, and watch the video. It is her deck, so no one can explain it any better than she can. So I will be adding a link to her video in the description below and I will also add a link to her video at the end of this video so make sure that you are checking her out. Now before we go right into the games here I do have one thing to say and that is we hit 100 subscribers! That's right. I told you guys we were going to hit that goal this week, and here we are on Wednesday, and we hit that goal. Uh, for you, it's Friday, but on Wednesday, we hit 100 subscribers. In fact, we did it real time while playing this deck, and uh, you will see that in the video. Uh, so that is really freaking cool. I cannot tell you how much I appreciate uh, all the support that you guys are giving to the channel. And I cannot wait for the things to come. So what does 100 subscribers mean? Well, it means that our next goal is 500 subscribers. Right? Naturally. Not 200. Not 300. Not 400. 500. That is our next goal. So ladies and gentlemen, let's get it. Now... If you have not subscribed to the channel yet, that's fine. About 92% of you guys that are watching my videos have not subscribed. I still am overwhelmed by how much you guys are enjoying uh, the content I'm providing. But it would be a big help if you could subscribe. So just do so. You can hit the button down in the bottom right hand corner. It literally takes just a second. And uh, like I said, would offer so much support to this channel. All right. The time for talking is over. The time for playing is now. All right. So what we're trying today is the mono black deck that Ash Lizzle uh, blew up on. And see how we do with it. Spoiler alert, probably not that good. But we are going to give it a go. We are going to give it a go. Okay, this is very interesting. Keep the land. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Creature, to creature token. No blocks. Or a treasure token, not a creature token. Play a little Gix here. See what he's going to do. Sure. Absolutely. Absolutely. That is 100% fine. He's down to two cards. Don't see much pressure coming from him. Uh, I think once this, this Lunark veteran is gone... Uh, oh, that's interesting. So he doesn't even have to... Uh, even if it's indestructible, he can still destroy it. Destroy target artifact. Or did he destroy a treasure... And I didn't notice it. Yeah, he must have destroyed a treasure. And I didn't notice it. Okay. Yeah, we'll go ahead and... Take care of that. All right. This is going exactly how I thought it would. Not the best. Alright, let's see what he does now. One card. Five creatures. One has menace, but it only deals one. I'm at eight. He's at fourteen. He's on a two turn clock. He doesn't do anything. So let's see. Oh, okay. All right. I'll do this. Awful. I still don't see anything where he can stop my flyer, so... Actually, I could have... I meant to attack with him, too. So, can he do one, two, three, four, five, six? Okay. I can only block one. Oh, wow. Okay. So, I think that's a, a GG's. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that don't... That doesn't do much of anything, does it? Like, he's still going at it. He's like... Like, you realize this is six, and you have six, right? You have nothing that can block this. Yeah, there he goes. All right, want to know. We'll see how this goes, but I don't think that's the way this deck was supposed to play. Hmm, well... I mean, it's not awful... 
I'd like another swamp, but this is fine. I mean, surely we're going to get another, we'll draw another swamp by turn four. Everything else in the hand is playable. So, we are on the play, and or on the draw, and that kind of sucks. Yep. That helps. I'm do a little... Got a dumper. Can't really. We need lands. I'm gonna kill one of the lore keepers next turn with the life of Toshiro Umizawa. Let's see, never punished, I guess, but I'd much rather have had a a land. We can do it like that. Slow him down a little bit. I'm sure he's got something for three or four that he's going to be able to play no problem. But See, and that thing's a menace. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll kill the other one. That thing's uh, it's a ward two now. So, like, I can't do anything till next turn. He's going to get at least one turn with it, and honestly, that's uh, not good for us. I really don't want to spend my turn four uh, taking care of a hulking raptor, and I'm probably not. Probably not. Is that till end of turn? Oh, yeah, definitely not now. So we're going to play Shieldred. Um, play Shieldred because she has Death Touch. Oh, that has Reach. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. It'll let me draw a card, though. So Hawking Raptor. I'm just glad he doesn't really have much in his hand. Except another hawking raptor. Yeah. Yeah, one is, is definitely going. I'm going to actually block both of them. Alright, so now we want to... I mean, fucking die, really. There's not a whole lot for us to do here. This is stupid, man. Is there anything? I, c I could sacrifice this and do five to it. Yep, that's what we're going to have to do. That's the only only way that we were going to be able to handle that. Yep. What a big pile of shit this is. Big super pile of shit, that's all. I think this is okay. I mean, we're alive. He can still attack with this thing. What's the payout on it? Okay, so he can't now. Unless he had, yeah, he can't attack with it now. So, what can I go get? Let's see, one, two, three, four. She legendary. So this is going to cost one, two, three. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can Takayuma and bring back She Aldered. That is the play here. That 
That is the play here. Uh, I can't afford to attack. I mean, I'm feeling okay. It all depends on what he's got in his hand, what he drew. He's, uh, doesn't seem like he really did much. He's going hard, hard for it. Wow. Like, this is amazing. I think we... Um... I think we go for, uh, like, I think she altered is our Aklazots. Like, I got rid of his thing. He's only got this. One card in hand that wasn't good enough to play last turn. You think Aklazots is the key here? Yeah, because I don't have any more she alters. So Aklazots is, is the play. Yeah. I'm fine with this. Again, it's a big contingent upon this. Let's see what he does with it. Nothing. Um... We attack, that takes us up to six. I can block him. These two. I can block here. I'm just going to pass the turn. Oh my lord. How lucky. Doesn't matter. The big the big guy is going to get blocked by So he's blocking big guy. She's blocking here and he's blocking here. We'll let 5 go through. Okay, I like that. So now, we still can't attack. Still can't attack. What'd he draw? How's he still got 43 cards in his deck? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay. So, 60 card deck. He's thinking awful hard. Is he thinking really hard or did he... No, nope, there he is. Yeah. I figured he didn't have much of a draw. I just need to come up with five, right? Do we sack this? Yeah.
Like, how many lands are in this freaking deck, huh? Okay. Okay. Right? He didn't know I only drew lands. I'll take it. 2 and 0. Oh. Don't feel like I'm 2 and 0, oh, but I'm 2 and 0. Oh. Whatever cards you needed then, you're going to need the next game. Or you're going to get first first hand in the next game. You have all the answers. Oh, but wait, you're not going to draw them. It's just the way it works. Oh, look at this. Look at look at that beauty. Look at that beaut. Watch how perfect this guy draws. Watch how perfect this is for him. Oh, see? I mean, what what I tell you? What did I tell you? Voice of the Blessed. Four of them in a hundred, hundred and twenty card deck. I'm just wondering if people just don't care. And here I am laying screwed again for the second game running. Ugh. Even though I couldn't draw anything but lands in game two. Alright. <laughs> Come on, dude. Give me give me some cards here. See what he does. He chose wrong. He chose wrong. What is this card? Okay. Still would like to have a land, please, and thank you. Instead, I want to see what this last card he's got is. It's probably a land. I mean, why do you keep touching that? You're not getting anything out of that. Okay. All right. A voice of the blessed out of a hundred, out of a hundred cards. That is what he drew. What do we, how do we like that? Out of a hundred cards, he drew a voice of the blessed. Sure. Now this is what I like to see. I was going to play Massacre Girl, but... I just... Like that's the problem with this card. I feel it's it's like why would I play this when I have this on turn four? Like why would I ever play this? So we're gonna be on this train now. I will drop down Massacre next turn. Beautiful. Look at look how beautiful this is. I'm actually going to take this. Actually didn't want to talk with the or attack with the memory. Yeah, 
You got that negative one on there, bro. What you gonna do? What are you gonna do, big dumb dick? What are you gonna do? You can gain six this turn. But it's getting... It's getting a little rough for you. I won't attack. Okay. 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 Yep. You're gonna gain seven. Put you at uh thirteen. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and all out attack here. He has to do something or he's dead. He has to block something. I'm going to draw cards. He's still taking 10. Um, we're going to kill that first. I didn't even I didn't even think about that. So What is that? 3 and 1. 3 and 1. Oh, these two hand Oh, I'm going first too. Uh these two landers, man, but I mean I'm just uh, I didn't realize that this thing's hand was a was a lock or was a chain. <laughs> I did not realize it. Didn't even realize it. I thought he had hands. It's funny. Ah, oh, see, see. Mm -mm. I just need one more land, guys. Heck. One more land. I'll, I'll, I'm, I'm happy with that. Because now we can draw some cards and get some more land. Because now I, I really only need one more land. Yeah, there it is. All right. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Sure, I can play Massacre Girl next turn. Ooh, and now I'm just gonna get full of lands. And unless, uh, unless anything is done to her, like I can even deal with him because I can just candy grapple. Just doesn't even matter. He's playing uh, pure control here. So do we play mask or girl again? I think we do. I think we do. Next turn we can maybe go find something. Does he have a, another sunfall? Is he gonna sunfall my massacre girl? Hmm. Is he going to attack with that thing? Yeah, I'm not going to block that. Come on, dude. I'm not going to block that. Okie dokie. Yeah, what, can you, what can you do, you know? This, uh... I'm going to activate this. And, uh... He's at 10, so I'm going to go get a shield altered. My favorite card. Okay, that's a second Sunfall. So. Let's see what he's got going on. He's at 10. 
I'll go full force here. He can flash this back for four, but he's going to take some damage here. Mm-hmm. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Yeah. Yep, can't can't afford to do that, can you? No, he can. Wow, this guy is Whoo! I'm just playing this one straight up. Make him use it again. Non land permanent, right? Like, what is this junk? Like, this is junk. I mean, cool, you're trying something new, but this is... I just don't see this as being anything really worth... I'm gonna just keep attacking here, because he's at 8. I'm ready to win this game before he pulls some weird shit out. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's over. Two, yeah, it, unless he has a something to kill this with his two mana, go for the throat, infernal grasp or whatever that one's called. Looks like GG's to me. Name I can't pronounce. You played that like it was it, like that was the only thing you had, and now it looks to me as if you have um, left the game. So. That's a that that is a uh, shameful loss for you. Shame. Anyway, I'll be back. Well, probably at the end of the game. It's beer Bach Brazilianer. We just played him the other day. What is he? Is he German? Is he Brazilian? We will never know. But what we do know, ladies and gentlemen, for those of you watching this video, I've already mentioned to you, probably in my intro, when I go to record my intro, sometime in the future after making this video with the games, that I just checked and we've hit 100 subscribers. Real time news droppage, ladies and gentlemen. Real time news a droppage. 100. Let's go. We can only celebrate this one way. And that is with a win. And looking at this hand, I think we are going to get a win. Hopefully. Because he has nothing. And then he had something. But now I can actually give that a little, a little candy grapple. Give that a little candy grapple. Bring in the fairy dream thief. I know that's the only Shieldred I have in the deck. I, I can play a Gix next turn. We're going to keep it. Probably not the best, but I mean, he's got nothing going on here. Shieldred can finish off this game. So, okay, I'll candy grapple that one too. Beer Brosh Brazilianer. Yeah, now you've got your white land, so you can play that, but that is okay. We're not worried about that right here, right now. Right here, right now. So hopefully we draw a land here. If we don't draw a land, we can get Gix down. Oh, come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this game is already over. And Beer, Bosch, Brazilianer, Beer, Bach, Brazilianer, knows more about this being a win for us than he does what nationality he is. He knows. 
Coming at him. Hard. Hard. It's over. 2-0 and oh against the beer bock. 2-0 and oh against the beer bock. I'm calling it right now. We can continue to play games. See? Hmm. <laughs> D E E Leeted. Let's go. That is a win for the 100 subscribers out there. That one is for you. Let's get it. Woo! I'm pumped. We're also 5 and 1 right now. 5 and 1 with this deck right now. And I am telling you, I tried this deck before. Uh, back when I was in Platinum. So at the beginning of the month. When it was first circulating. I tried it. And I couldn't win a damn game. So 5 and 1. Let's go. 100 subscribers. Let's go. Hmm. big dumb deck like they just really need to fix this the, the shuffler like there is absolutely if i i swear to goodness if i build a 200 card deck and i don't draw perfect i'm probably deleting the game which i'm not going to actually do this because i don't want to delete the game but it's like look, look, look at this. this guy's playing a 80 card deck like seriously, what is th what is this noise, man? And this is a, this is just Boros. He's playing eighty card Boros deck. <laughs> just everybody, everybody today is playing big dumb decks. That's all I'm gonna label them as. Like, as far as I'm concerned, you like this is big, it's and it's a dumb deck, big dumb deck. <sighs> I shouldn't be so nasty about it, but it just, it's just, like, it just doesn't make any any sense to me whatsoever. That's fine. You can't pump her up right now. And I'm going to go ahead and give you the old candy. That candy grappler. Big dumb deck. That's a card. I'm only going to draw the two. I guess I could have pumped him up, but you know I just didn't know what I was going to do after the uh, after the draw. I was not sure on my. Grapple this this lady again. Old warden. Big booms. Uh, let's see. Uh, honestly, let's just decline the rest. I think we're good. I think we're good. Play the preacher. That's a blocker. Not that it matters too much, but... So who are you going to do? The bat? Yeah. It's fine. Can he play her? Yep. He sure can. But does he attack? He sure does. He sure does. There's no thought process going on up in here. Zero thought process. It's just put down creatures and attack. So. Uh, 
There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, and yeah, it doesn't matter. We'll just pump him up once here. It doesn't matter. He's dead. Already doesn't matter. He is a big dead. Get out of here, Morvidus. You know, you could have played a better Boros deck with 20 less cards. That's what I expect to see from a big dumb deck. And that wasn't even a big dumb deck. It was like a medium dumb deck. Anytime I get to six wins, I'm happy. You know, five wins. You know, 50%. You're not going anywhere. You just... Just trudge them. Does this do anything? I mean, it's a blocker. We'll do it like this. Maybe he took a one-lander. Nope, but it seems as if he may not have anything. So not even a kill spell. No priorities there. Pi 89. What do you got? Surely. Surely not, bud. Surely you're not drawing dead over there. Still no priorities. I had to check his deck to make sure it wasn't a big dumb deck because that's, that's what people are playing today. Big dumb decks. What? I just love it. I, I do love it. I love it when when I have to read a card because I'm like has anybody ever played this card before and, and the answer is typically no nope sure haven't is that a sorcery no it's an instant it is an instant spell if it was a sorcery then I would understand I mean it, it costs three <laughs> that's that's not good. I mean, you take away the artifact, and, and then you've got a one-mana cheaper version of that. What? Wow, dude. Like, this is... This is just amazing. I'll still get her benefits. So we can draw that card. <clears throat> I'm just going for it, man. It's like he's either got a sweeper or he doesn't at this point. Right? I mean, could. He's got he's got the land for it. He's definitely playing I don't know, some kind of something, right? Never mind. Nothing with sweepers it seems. Okay. Is this a, like a no rares deck maybe? I don't know. He's not, he's playing with basics and everything. You know what time it is. All the preachers. Uh, you can't. Okay, there you go. I was gonna say you can't. You can't do it like that. He's going to kill him first, and you're going to gain a few life. Ooh, that's something. That makes our next turn very interesting. That's something that he probably drew. I'm going to tell myself he drew that, and that I uh, did not make a mistake by not playing the bat that last turn.
All right, now here is the question. Does he block with his shielded? Oh, yeah. I just, I, I was like, why can't I attack with my shoulder? Well, it's because I just played her this turn. Like, what in the world? I, I don't even know, but I'm just going to take it because I, I, I have no no idea how I want to do that. It's fine. That is a okay. See what he does. I want to say he'll attack with the mi uh, missionary. That's what I'm thinking. And I'll block with the 1-1 one, one and candy grapple it. What are we doing here? Pi. 89. He is doing nothing. So let's uh, let's draw a card. Nothing in here. And I'm back on that, you know, land flood draw. Okay, so we are going to attack, attack, and attack with these guys. See what he does. He's scared, man. He is so scared. I'm just going to go get my uh, Arch Fiend. I don't think there's anything you can do about it at this point. And that should be GG's. Interesting. So, why did he wait till his main phase to do that? Okay. He just made this easy. He just made this super easy. Yep. That's that's win number seven. So we can only go seven and three. Sounds pretty good to me. I doubt this is his real name, but I would not even, like, I hope it's not his real name. Yeah, looks like we've got us a blue-white player. Let's see what kind of blue-white player. I still get to see your hand, Ryan. I still get to see your hand, and you know, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm playing with uh, house money, because 
you know. I, uh... See if he dissipates this. I, uh... I'm already won seven games. Yeah, good, see. Little dissipation. Now, from what I can tell in his hand, he's got several turns before he can even play a card. And maybe, just maybe, I'll draw another bat. And he won't draw it. <laughs> sometimes. Oh, sometimes, Dick. Sometimes you hurt me. And sometimes... You make me feel so, so good. So we're playing the case here. I was hoping maybe he would, uh... But, like, I'm going after that emperor with my bat. So I'm just, I'm hoping... Well, crap. I was going after the emperor with that, but now I'm going to have to go uh, after the march. Unless he just goes ahead and marches me. I hate it. I really hated it. I really hate it. He still can't play his Emperor. Um, so... I don't care about no Dream Thief. I mean, you want to Ottawara something? You can. Uh, we'll play the, we'll play play the preacher here, and we're gonna leave it at that. Okay. Gonna be tough to get rid of now. Um, actually, not as tough as I thought, but I mean, I still, I can still only hit it with one creature a turn. I mean, that doesn't matter. I, like, I, I don't even know why. I don't know why I did it that way because it really doesn't matter. Just wow. I mean, I could play Virtue next turn, right? If he if he doesn't use his march. Or maybe he just quit. Maybe he feels like he did not have a path of victory. So, we'll see. But, until then, I will be back when maybe he's back. Or at the end of the game. I don't know. It's a surprise. I'll let you know how it turns out.
while I'm waiting, I'll, uh... Okay. So, is he, is he back, or...? I don't know if he's back or not. I'm guessing he's not back. I mean, I, I get that I have what I have, and maybe he didn't draw a sweeper or, or something, but, you know, I don't feel like he was losing the game by any means. I mean, he could have taken out my cavern bat, my deep cavern bat with the uh, otherworldly light. He had the hall breaker he would get back. I don't know what this card is. Maybe it's a land, and maybe drawing that land was enough to really uh, make him angry, but enough to like quit or, or or maybe just disconnected and we really don't know what's going on but either way um at the end of the day it's a win and that win means that we went eight and two with ash lizzle's ma uh massacre girl deck so still just felt like mono black to me uh, i i uh, i think we could have uh I think we could have taken Massacre Girl out and, and put different removal in and, and uh, you know, put four She Aldreds in there and maybe a Corrupt or hell anything and it would have done really the same thing. It's Mono Black and Mono Black is pretty freaking good. Well, I hope you enjoyed those games. You know I did. If you stuck around to the end, I appreciate you so very much. Watching all the way to the end actually means uh, a lot to the channel. So thank you, thank you, thank you. If you are still here and you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. Again, you just have to hit the button down in the bottom corner of the screen. Uh, if you need to collect more evidence, pun intended, for Karlov Manor. No? Well, if you do, go ahead and check out... Where's it at? This one? Oh, yeah, this video right here. Also, this video right here will take you over to Ash Lizzle's channel and right to the Mono Black Massacre Girl deck. Thank you again for watching. Have a wonderful rest of your day.